going to look like a race car when we're done. Hi, I'm Jen, and you're watching the Corvette Channel. We're here on a Saturday morning, and it's about 9 o'clock in the morning, and we've got Anton's car uh, from, he's down from, An or I should say up from Anaheim, California. He's driven up here for us to do the work on his car today. This is a 2017 uh, Stingray. And you can see here that uh, it's got uh, the front, the regular front grille, the Stingray front grille. Uh, it's, it's a typical Stingray. It's got, um, it's got the, uh, you know, no, no splitter in the front, no side skirts. Um, he does have a, the upgraded Z51 uh, 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 sub, um, spoiler on the back of it. Um, but we are going to be converting this car from this uh, today over to um, putting on a stage, uh, I guess it's a stage two and a half uh, front splitter as well as side skirts and also uh, rear diffusers here and a ZR1 wing. All these parts are from Extreme Online Store and so um, we are excited to be able to do this. We've done, as you know, we've done a bunch of videos on this before, but we've always done like just the particular front end or the back end uh, at one time. We've never done uh, this much work in one day on a car. Uh, but we're trying to make sure that we accommodate for him because he's driving all the way up here and we don't want to keep him here. Um, we want to be able to get him on the road and, and heading back home today. So um, we'll we'll show you some pictures along the way of what it looks like as we've got it tore apart. Um, we're not going to actually film all of the installation because you guys will already have that. And I'll put some links of, of that in the video so you can get to those if you want and uh but we'll so stay tuned and we'll show you the uh the ending part okay what it looks like i bet you it's going to look like a race car when we're done all right stay tuned guys we pretty much got the car tore apart here I'll take a look at the front and back bumpers sitting there got Terry working on the back end of it John's been bouncing between the front and the back helping us you can take a look here there's the front of it we're just gonna be gonna go through all this just to be able to change the grill isn't this a pain in the butt yeah but uh, it's definitely going to look like a total different car here in just a very short amount of time. I'm going to take a look at this. Antoine's trying to contain his I know, I know, yeah. yeah. All, all, these all these wonderful noises, huh? All these wonderful noises. He's he's sitting here inspecting all of our work. And uh, we keep warning him. Yeah, be, be prepared for the loud snaps and cracks and all that type of stuff. And... And we haven't even gotten to the fun part yet, which is where we're going to start drilling holes in the top of this bumper. And that, that I think he's probably going to plug his ears. Hi, everybody. You guys all see Terry and I doing these installations on these videos as we show you how to go about doing it. And I'm always saying that if you guys don't want to do this yourself, don't want to tackle it yourself, to reach out and we'll give you a quote on how to do it. Well, a lot of you guys have done that. And in doing so... Um, we are now very busy doing this and we've actually turned this into a business. So um, if you are needing anything done as far as, you know, like you've seen us do a front nose, you've seen us do wings, you've seen us do aero kits, all that type of stuff, reach out to us, we'll get you a quote. If you're in this area, man, we'll be happy to take care of you. Um, and we've also had some people contact us from uh, Florida from Yosemite, from Los Angeles, and people are bringing their cars um, all the way as far as Las Vegas um, for us to do the, the work. So um, I haven't ever really advertised that. I always have just kind of in passing, I just say, oh, you know, if you want us to do it, reach out, we'll give you a quote. But we are fully going forward with that, and, and it's turning out to be a pretty, pretty cool little deal. Um, most of the people know that 
by doing what we're doing, they know we know what we're doing because they've seen us actually do the work. And so I've actually offered people that have been far enough away, I've offered to say, hey, you know, be sure to tell your body shop, um, don't do this, do this, don't do that, whatever it may be, just to make sure that they don't do any damage to the car. And people are saying, no, nope, we just want you guys to do it. So um, if you guys knew, are in need of any of this type of work being done, let me know, reach out to me. I'm gonna get that information right here on the screen and we'll be happy to help you. All right, so now we've got the new Z06 grill in this thing. Look at that, doesn't it look great? All right, so next step is go put it back on the car. All right, well, while we're doing the, uh, while we got everything tore apart, as you guys know, John doesn't normally uh, like to clean filming stuff like shit. that. But, oh yeah, I'm, we're filming it. So, but he's cleaning the customer's car, isn't that great? <laughs> bumper back on we've tested the lights they're working so now we're gonna go ahead and finish putting it back together with the Corvette channel. We just received our new wind restrictor today. To get yours, go to the link below, mention the Corvette channel, and you'll receive your 10% discount. All right, guys, she's finished. So we're just gonna get her down and roll her out. And I've been watching the grin on his face the whole day. And you can look at it right there. He's smiling, smiling. <laughs> Uh, so we'll get it out here in the sun so we can see it, see what it looks like. All right, guys. Well, here we go. We're at the end of the day, and we have got a new front splitter, side skirts, wing, and diffusers on this car. And I can tell you that this thing looks... Oh, and I forgot the, the new Z06 grill, too. So take a look at that. I mean, that thing just looks awesome. Now, like I said... It went from a regular Stingray to looking like a race car. It is amazing the difference of how this looks. All right, guys. So one other thing that we did is I was I was telling Ant, uh, Anton that uh, I thought his car would look even better if he had a black glass roof. So I took the roof off of my car over here and I transferred it over to his his car. And you got guys, tell me what you think. I mean, I just think with the white and that extra black that it just looks so much better. So I told him I says, you know, you need to go out and find yourself a new roof. So he may be interested in this. He hasn't seen it yet, but if he is, when I go to edit this, I'll let you guys know that he is interested. And if you guys happen to have a roof, let him know, okay? Or let me know, and I'll let him know. All right. But uh, man, this thing just—it just pops now. I cannot believe 
what a difference this is. This is a uh, this is a one LT two 2017 uh, base Stingray, and that's what we started out with. And look what we got now. I mean, this thing just looks awesome. All right, I'm I'm here with the fellas on the Corvette channel. Uh, as you can see, this is their work. Hey, these guys are, are the real deal, real professional. Um, I'm happy. I, I, I drove almost 500 miles, and it was worth every mile. So if, if you guys have stuff to do, this is the place. <laughs>